You'll see players using the banana kick when placed in a tight angle. The banana kick has become one of the most important kicks in today's game. And one bloke who does it better than most is Western Bulldog skipper Chris Grant. The banana is a kick which takes a lot of work to get right. But once you do master the art, you should have a fair amount of control over it. You need to hold the ball as though kicking a reverse torpedo punt. Basically, if you're a right foot kick, it will be your right hand which is placed forward on the ball and the opposite for the left footers out there. The angle you should hold the ball at should be the same as you would for a torpedo. The grip will count for little if you don't release the ball properly. It needs to be guided down so that it makes contact at an angle across your boot. The aim is to bend the ball when shooting for goal from a sharp angle. For a right footer to make the ball move from left to right, the kicking boot needs to make contact with the left hand end of the ball. A left footer will want it to bend from right to left and so will kick the right hand end of the ball. There is quite a bit of judgement in getting the right bend on the ball. The closer to the point and end you connect, the more sharply the ball will bend. Also, this is the one kick where your kicking foot does not go directly towards its target. You need to kick in a straight line at a point that will allow the ball to bend through the goal. Take it slowly and practice it step by step. Find a place where you can practice a banana without having to kick it very far. A great idea is to grab a friend, have him stand in the goal square of your local ground while you practice from just beyond the point post. Once you're on top of the banana kick, you will find it a very useful skill. Ronnie Byrne, just to finish them off, some magic for Ronnie! Great advice there, kids. But whatever you do, don't forget to work hard on your non-preferred side. If you're naturally a right footer, then work hard on getting your left foot skills up to scratch. There aren't too many top players these days who can't kick well on both sides of their body.